Oh. The shield is ended. That which will not bend must break. The broken will become my vessel. I am here. Those who do not know me will know me when they hear the knock. Hello YouTube, it's Balamore here, back again with more Blind Gaming and a new LP for the channel. Hooray! This one's called the Mortuary Assistant. For the PC, of course. I'll leave a link below in the description. It's free to play. You can check it out for yourselves if you want before or after the video. We are a uh, mortuary assistant, apparently, and we got called into work late to help out a colleague. And I believe this is our first time we're going to be doing the um, embalming procedure alone and uh it's an indie horror game so what could go wrong uh, i hope you guys enjoy this i definitely will i play tested this it looked really cool i am blind i've got no center vision so like i usually say if i can do this you most certainly can do this without further ado let's do this Oh, here we are. Turn my headset up. Of course, there's a thunderstorm going on outside. Oh, yeah. Uh, too bad there's no rain effects on the window. I always like that when they add the, the raindrops. But it looks pretty good. Uh-oh. Wait. I lost track of where I was. Oh, no. Okay. Take two. I won't edit that out. That was silly. We'll see if I can do this again. So if you click, but if you like, like I went off of it and I didn't know where the light switch was. I probably was like over here or something. All right. So we came into work. Oh yeah. Add the spooky atmosphere. So here's the checklist he left us. All right. Let's, I'll have to take a picture of that and enhance it when we get in here. And there's our body. So he prepped the body. He probably drained it, right? Yeah, he drained the blood. Got a little X where you need an injector with the um, embalming needle, I'm assuming. It takes a special person to actually um, embalm. She had some... She was a well-endowed lady all her life. Not that I'm finding that attractive, I just... Could you imagine, though, if, if if I was a girl and I had giant boobs? Like, when I got older and they were sagging, like, <laughs> way down. That would be really hard on my back. I think I would get a boob reduction. What the hell is here? I can kind of sprint. This is a spooky job, though. You have to have, like... You can't be afraid of ghosts. Because if you're afraid of ghosts, being a um, mortician would really stink. Did they come from the back room? Got an air conditioner. Yeah, you probably have to have it nice and cold in here. So, I'm assuming we put on our lab coat first. Okay, and then gloves, right? Okay, good. We probably should have washed our hands on top of that. There's no sink in here. Maybe it's in another room. Well, we have gloves on. I guess they're dead. Does it really matter? I would think so, though. You would think you want to wash your hands. It's probably in that room. Alright, 
Okay, so the first thing we got was wear coat and gloves. All right, that's easy enough. The next thing we have to do is bring out the tools, and then we have to create the embalming fluid, which is three chemicals. And then we have to cut her open, which the X marks the spot there. And then we have the injector, et cetera, et cetera. So we'll, we'll go down that list as we as we progress here. And it says, thank you with a smiley face. So dumb. <laughs> you have to have, like, a special personality. There's the machine. Bombing machine. Okay, so tools are first. So we got ourselves a needle. We got the... Oh, okay. That is a big-ass needle. It's not like that we feel it when we're dead. That's a scalpel, right? Some crazy noises. What are, what's this? Oh, the syringe for the needle? Okay. What else we got going on over here? That was a needle... Can we clean up? I know it doesn't say to clean up, but... Okay, maybe that's not it. I feel like we're missing uh, a tool here, right? Oh, okay. What is this? Can't tell. Uh, it's some tool. Maybe it's like gauze or something. That's what I was thinking. Now, this chemical looks hidden. Yeah. All right. We're doing good. Oh, you know what I should have? Um, huh. <laughs> Slit your throat. Is it going to be there? Nope, of course not. Weird. Uh, is this a chemical? It is. So there's two. Alright, there's going to be a third one. Yep. I wonder if she's haunting this, this place. Is this the other one? That is. Okay, now we got to cut her open. God. Okay, I just got cold chills. That was good. Gonna be something out here. Just for effect. <laughs> Is there a light switch in here? There's gotta be, right? Okay, that I wouldn't be able to see again. So I don't dare... Turn that on. All right, we gotta take the scalpel. Oh, maybe not. Yeah, we gotta cut her, cut her open. Oh! The shield is ended. That which will not bend must break. The broken will become my vessel. I am here. Those who do not know me will know me when they hear the knock. The shield is ended. That which will not bend must break. The broken will become my vessel. I am here. Those who do not know me will know me when they hear the knock. Oh god. Do you know me? Uh I know you. Okay. <laughs> oh, she's walking. Uh Okay, that's that's freaking me out. Upside down crosses. No, they're swords. They're not upside down crosses. Six, six, six. Oh my god. These must be like all satanic symbols. Oh god. Is that the Star of David with circles around it? Oh no. These must be like just symbols, cult symbols and stuff. So a demon is in her. Something about a vessel, which would be the dead lady. 
Oh no. Not like she's in her body feeling that though. Yeah, we're gonna ignore that. <laughs> oh come on. It's making us do this. Alright, big boy pants. What do you guys think she's going to do when we go out there? You think she's going to let me escort her back on the table? And then we'll just treat this as if it never happened? Or my coworker's going to never hear from me again and her body's going to be gone along with me? Or maybe she'll be here when the mortician gets here and I won't be here. I think she's going to kill me. <laughs> Uh-oh, I can't move. Oh, God. Ooh. Oh, that was so good. That truly was a good little short horror game. I liked it. The end there was really cool. The cracking and the twisting and then getting me. The Mortuary Assistant. Bravo. That was a good little horror game. Little gem. Very, very short for sure, but uh, a good little gem in the rough. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. I, I liked this. It was short. I wish there was more to it, but... Yeah, that was good. Very well done. No graphical glitches. But yeah, I, I hope this turns into a full game, or maybe this is the full game. I'll keep an eye on this one. I liked it. But on to the next game, guys. So thanks so much for watching. I love you. You're awesome. Until next time. As always, later.